Good morning, cultists. Welcome back to another unbalanced breakfast with Kuta Loops. In our last episode, we ended things off after having spoken to uh, Lady Ashbury, the red-headed uh, vampire lady um, that we met before previously. And it turns out she's being blackmailed, and now we need to talk to the local hospital gossip to see if perhaps she might know of anything. I don't know why she gets a room all to herself. Though I will raid her closet. Sadly, I did not get her panties. Which makes me sad. What? What is this? Who are you? Get out of my room. There's no need for alarm, madam. I'm Dr. Reed, the new surgeon. Preposterous. Dr. Reed, you say? I don't want some bumbling intern. Where's Dr. Swansea? Bumbling intern? You've got to be kidding me. Please, calm down, madam. I assure you that I am highly qualified. I'm just back from war duty. <laughs> how brave. Threatening an old defenseless woman. You know how long I've been a patient here. You've picked the wrong fight. I'm Harriet Jones. Harriet Jones? Indeed. I've been meaning to have a chat with you. You know what goes on here better than any other patient, I gather. Oh, better than any patient, nurse or doctor. I've seen so many vile undertakings. I heard there have been some despicable goings on. Was there a case of blackmail? Blackmail? I... Wait. You're investigating something. This isn't a social call. One of those incompetent cunts lit a poor sod's vein. Are you kidding me? Watch your fucking mouth, you... Uncouth, slanderous, pulsating sack of shit. Uh, you like gossip? If I didn't know better, Miss Jones, I'd be inclined to say you enjoy this type of idle gossip. God's honest truth, Doctor. It's just the way it is here. Most of these bitches would let you freeze to death before getting you a blanket. I'll let you freeze to death. You seem to know more about the goings-on here than anyone else. Beware, Miss Jones, in case suspicion should fall on you. That's it. Blame the old and infirm. I see those little bitches' greedy little eyes. Just waiting for me to pop off, they are. Uh, yeah, I'd love for you to pop off. I assure you, madam, this is not an investigation into a possible medical error. Debauchery, then? Nurses Crane, Hawkins, Brannigan's, whores, all of them. They can't keep their legs shut. I've seen them scratching slutty sores. Really? Well, if you have irrefutable proof, I'll not have the staff behaving in such a manner here. This is your business, Doctor, not mine. But I swear one of the nurses is cavorting with some man on hospital hours. Thank you for your time, Miss Jones. You've given me something to go on. See you on the next round. Oh, uh, wait. Can I talk to her see if she's sick? Miss Jones, greetings. How do we feel? Again? Waking a poor old woman in her sleep? There isn't a poor life needs saving somewhere? Uh, oh, I guess I can't really ask her about a no. condition. I need to well. write questions. Oh, I see. Have you noticed any suspicious comings or goings? It would be a great deal easier to make a list of things unsuspicious in this house of charlatans. <laughs> Come now, Miss Jones. Surely it's not that bad. <laughs> Have you no eyes? This hospital accepts all manner of souls, regardless of origin. The proper sick cannot heal. We're kept sickened by the refugees. Wow. Everyone here is very capable. I have not seen any instances of unprofessionalism. Thieves and murderers the lot. People have gone missing here, you know. Poof, without a trace. Yeah, I can arrange the same for you. If you could just tell me why you were admitted. It's terrible, Doctor. What with a pain in my chest, coughing up blood, and I get awfully tired. Wouldn't be so bad if I hadn't lost my house and all. I see. No one comes to visit, you know. Not even my own flesh and blood. Blood, you say? I'll come and visit you shortly. Good night, Miss Jones. Alright, fine. Um, I don't know if she's actually sick or if she's just fucking around, but... 
Oh, right. She's... Oh, okay. She's the not the actual last person. Know something. I'll start my investigation with that. Mm hmm. Okay, so I guess we need to talk to all the nurses. I know Peepa is, um... Definitely one of the suspects. Good evening, Nurse Hawkins. Good evening, Dr. Reed. What can you tell me about the strange man visiting one of the nurses during her shift? Let me guess. You spoke with our old shrew, Harriet Jones. Do not pay attention to her, Doctor. She's full of fanciful tales. Well, I mean, you have been banging Milton, right? Hmm. She could have said the truth. Uh, I guess she doesn't No matter how help. you feel about her, Miss Jones deserves our help. Who says I don't care for her? Hate is what keeps the old crone alive. <laughs> she could have been telling the truth about the mysterious man. That old witch will end up in hell soon enough. Who cares if a nurse finds some happiness where she can? Uh, is that you? Are you... You're obviously the one banging, right? What can you tell me about... Let Wait. me guess. Why is that still highlighted? Goodbye, Nurse Hawkins. I guess it's not really highlighted. All right, fine. Uh, next nurse that we need to speak to is, uh... Oh... Oh, what a boo. I don't think she would... Ah, right, Brannigan. Hello, Brannigan. Good evening, Nurse Brannigan. Good evening, Doctor. Um, what? Okay, I see. Do you know if any of the hospital staff have criminal backgrounds? The people who work here all come from very different backgrounds, Doctor. Just like the patients. Right. Very diplomatic, ambiguous answer. Thank you have very you much. Have you seen a strange man visiting any of the nurses here? Besides I've me. I've never heard of such a thing, Doctor. Right, okay. Goodbye, nurse. Call me if you need assistance. Fine, I guess we need to talk to Dorothy Crane then. Alright, let's skedaddle on over. Um, she's usually upstairs, isn't she? Oh wait, she's down somewhere? Huh, I wonder if she's by the docks then. Alright. Oh, no, that's, uh, sorry, that's, um, uh, Mrs. Doubtfire. Right, Newton Blight. Got a very unfortunate name there, buddy. Eavesdrop. Uh, if a citizen is behaving suspiciously, see, their heart will emit a distinctive glow. Oh, I see, right, that's the whole, um, introduction about... Huh, interesting. You're sure you don't come back with me? Nah, I ought to see someone at the hospital. Be careful. You look so bad they may keep you as a patient. Fuck them. I don't like hospitals. Or doctors. Well then, when you go back to Whitechapel, you may find this useful. What is it? A pass for a free medical exam by the best nurse available. Just read it. I don't read well, but thank you, I guess. Oh, can I finally access the sewers now? Also, why the fuck is Dorothy constantly covered in blood? Has she never heard of, like, fucking sanitation or... Good grief. Fucking lady needs to clean up after herself. Oh. Hello, nurse. Scal nurse. Oh, shit. That's a leap. Okay, interesting. Very nice. I'll be taking that. Ho ho ho! Scal travelers! Thanks for... Um, well, they didn't really bring anything for me. Okay, so that's a... Bunch of barrels that I've now destroyed. Ooh! Yes, please. Okay, well, I'm just gonna do some exploring before we actually get into the sewers. Because there might be stuff around here. And I kind of get the feeling that we might be able to find, uh... A uh, Newton Blight's friend in the sewers once we decide to head on in. Uh, what's over there? Oh shit, a level... Oh wait, I'm level 9 now, so I can probably take on the Scal if I so choose. Alright, that being said though. I want to be a little careful. Let's stun his ass. Boom! Right. oh shit, I was gonna drink your blood, I'm sorry. Crap. 
Nice. There we go, you son of a bitch. Alright. The extra stamina is working out amazingly. Ausgezeichnet. Alright, got some more lead. Thank you very much. Now I can threaten to uh, fill someone up with lead. Which is obviously the a large knife. This must be oh. Clay Cox's knife. A fine blade. No wonder he wants it back. Right. Okay, no, I don't need that. Thank you very much. I don't need to join the ranks. I've served my time. Get out of my face. Alright, uh, so I noticed that we can actually teleport over this side. And, uh, huh. Wait, why is this box open? Were we already here before? We may have been. Hmm. Alright, just, just a little bit more exploring. Oh, spring, common trigger part. A lot of spring, actually. What the hell? Why was there just like a fucking trash can filled with springs? More springs! Is that what the people of London do? Is they just go around uh, throwing springs into, uh, into the rubbish? What the hell? Or maybe that's... Maybe they do that so that the garbage will um, bounce back up or something. Right, okay. Now that I've unlocked that... I'm gonna explore a little bit more. See what is uppity do. Anything over this side? No. What about here? Poplar Falberg. Whoa, I hear a lot of screaming. Whoa, okay! H.G. Griffin? Oh, why don't you just chillax there by yourself, bud? I have no interest in uh, getting into a Royal Rumble with you. What about over this side? Anything? Mmm, no, I believe this is kind of where we came from. Uh, I was really ex looking forward to being able to break these boxes. But, alright, fine, be that way. So I think we're basically back to where we were before. Alright, well, I don't see any need to uh, go over to that side right now. Alright, let's I go into the... Enter. What the shit? What about this one? It's locked. Eat my asshole. Oh, right, I guess, um, might need to go in through here. We've gone upstairs, right? Oh, we haven't. Lenora! Oops. Oh, shit. <laughs> what an awkward encounter. What a hilariously awkward encounter. Oh, no. They're looking for me. I gotta go. <laughs> I bump into some dude. <laughs> he turns out to be a vampire hunter. I swipe at him and like, oh, got a piece out. <laughs> oh well. Hearing some screaming. He's locked the door behind him. I Why need to find another way to follow him. Right. Don't worry. We'll follow. What lies over yonder? What is happening? Is he being devoured? Hey, man, you can't go getting devoured um, by yourself, dude. I gotta do the devouring for you, you asshole. Unbelievable. What a jerk. Hope you saved enough blood for the rest of the class. Jerkweed. That's right. This man has been savagely attacked and dragged to the floor. Right. Anything else for me to collect before I continue? Just teleport to all these... Great. It's like my favorite pastime now. Fantastic. Okay, can I lo unlock this from the side? Okay, good. Well, then. Right. Was he being attacked or... I, I mean, I guess he was being attacked, but okay. Alright, let me go sneak up on this bitch. Boom! Eat shit, punk nuts. Yeah. Uh-oh. Now you've fallen. Oh, crap. I didn't know that he could uh, do that. Shit. Alright, good to know. Good to know. Wow. Kinda sound like they're fucking vomiting. Sound like Gollum. Gollum on uh, steroids. Of course. Lots of stuff to loot. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, Scowman. 
I guess he can't hear me. <laughs> Fantastic. Alright, bitch. Whoa! Oh, damn. Okay. You're taken care of. I don't think so, bitch. Come on. Oh, fuck. You punk. It's supposed to be a flawless victory. You ruined my flawless victory. You flawed it. Asshole. Unbelievable. Such a jerk. Alright, can I take that? Thank you very much. And I wonder if this leads anywhere. Okay, so I guess that's where I have to go. Right, okay. So what's this other yelling and screaming that I'm hearing? I wonder if it's, um... If it's, uh... That guy's friend. Uh, Blight's friend. Alright, let's go find that out. Seems to be coming from this side. But I don't seem to be able to access it, though. Huh, alright. Maybe we'll follow this path, then. Alright, that's another rogue scowl. But I'm gonna go this side, just in case this is where... Uh, Blight's friend is. Citizen to save. Careful, the endangered citizen might not survive the next night. Go to check on him. Okay. Right. Before I do that, though, let me go looting uh, shit. Oh, and this is where I can exit. Okay. So I'm assuming I can uh, unlock that door. Just should I so choose. Cool beans. Ah, another door to unlock. Well, I'll get to you guys in a sec. Apparently, I need to f save some dude. Oh, a couple of these bastards, eh? Okay. Alright, you son of a bitch. Fantastic. Nice. Fant- Whoa, he's not dead? Oh, you son of a bitch. That's right. How about you have your blood sucked this time? Whoa, whoa, buddy. Take it easy, man. I'm just trying to kill you, that's all. Is he gonna be upset at having been saved by a vampire? He's gonna freak out at me. Should I not have used my vampiric powers in front of him? Do I have access to the Emma, uh, to the Men in Black uh, memory erasing technology? Can I just flash his eyes, like, with my dirty nutsack and then will make him forget before I speak to you, though? Thank you. Anything else to uh, take? Why does it look like you have some occult thing going on here? Were you trying to summon Cthulhu? Not the right way to Are summon you injured, him. Sir? Help me get out of here. I need to get out. I'm Dr. Reed, and I'd be glad to help you, but you must calm down first. Please, take a deep breath and tell me your name. Okay. Okay, I I'm Oswald Thatcher. Please, I need to get out. Mr. Thatcher, your friend Newton sent me to help you. Do you remember him? Yes. Yes, I do. Good. Now leave this place and enjoy the cool night air. It's quite invigorating. I'm sure you'll feel better if you do. Um, okay. He kind of looks like the love child of uh, Simon Pegg and Carl Pilkington. <laughs> Just like the shape of his, like the arrangement of his features as well as the shape of his head. I don't know. Citizen rescued. Fantastic. He'll return to the district the following night. Great. Alright, we are done here. Fantastic. Alright, so that's another one done. Um, oh, he's got a headache. Need to treat him with a cure for the headache. What, can he just not sleep it off and maybe drink some water or something? Do I really need to cure his fucking headache? I mean, I get it if you've got like a migraine, but is there? there's no cure for a migraine, so... I mean... It's not much you can really do about that. Oh, ho, ho. Mr. Rogue Scowl. Let me... You appear to be harboring too much blood in your veins. Let me help you with that. Fantastic. I don't think we need to consume the rats. We'll, we'll leave them for later, just in case we need it. Uh, can I loot your body? The Ban of the Dragon. Hmm. 
Okay, that's just more collectible intel. Cool beans. Uh, anything to take here? Yes, sir. A light regeneration serum. Oh, speaking of serums, I may have... Okay, no, I've already equipped it. Okay, that's good. So, I believe I can use serums by... Right, pressing up or down. Got it. Left and right, changes my weapons, etc. Cool. Um, has this guy been savaged already? Fuck me. Oh, God. Whoa! It's a fucking what werewolf? Sort of is this? Oh, my God. Although, with his mane and shit like that, he kind of looks like a were hedgehog. He's Sonic gone rogue. Oh, God. This is tough. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. My stamina. Crap all over it. All right, you son of a bitch. You might need to stun his ass a little bit. There we go. Fantastic. <laughs> That's hilarious. Drinking out of a uh, werewolf. Alright. Oh, fuck me. My stamina. Well, it's a good thing we got that uh, stamina um, upgrade. Okay, son of a bitch. I see you. Oh, fuck. You walked right into that one, didn't I? Let's heal up again. Just a little bit. Alright, punk bitch. Almost had him stun locked. Nice. Not today, motherfucker. Not today. Oh, shit. What the hell is that? What kind of infernal yelling? I don't appreciate you yelling in my ear, good sir. I do appreciate you getting attacked by my steak, though. Alright, let's drink out of him again. Fantastic. Heal up just in case. Nice. <laughs> he makes a very weird noise when he gets attacked. Ooh! <laughs> it's kind of cute. Kind of, kind of endearing. I gotta say. Not to sympathize with the enemy here, but you know. I mean, that's exactly what I'm doing. Oh shit. Hey man. Not cool, buddy. I thought we were bros. Don't attack me like that. Yeah, baby. Come on, bitch. Oh shit. Oh crap. Not today, Here's motherfucker. Left of him. Not a lot to check, but I should anyway. Fantastic. Can I loot the werewolf? Or... Or is that it? I can't loot him. What the fuck? And what's with the white stuff? Oh god, this is the werewolf's jism. Oh jeez. If you are sick, if you have no money, Whoever you are, wherever you're from, come see Dorothy to get help. No tricks, no charges, no questions asked. Just see Darius Petrescu's house and present this coupon. And that is written in a language that I do not understand. If anyone knows what that language is written, um, what that language is, please let me know. I Some would be... voucher for a free checkup in White. Whitechapel. What is Nurse Crane up to? Mm -hmm. I really must mm -hmm. find her. Okay, right, right. Okay, so we're on this one. Hmm. I've lost the trail of Nurse Dorothy Crane after her meeting with some shady gang member. Luckily, I found a useful hint on the man's corpse after some frenzied scowls murdered him. Some sort of coupon for a free medical exam in Whitechapel. The flyer is written in English and Romanian. Okay, Romanian. Oh, okay, so I guess uh, Nurse Crane is Romanian too. Interesting. Well, I, I knew she had an accent and I knew she wasn't really uh, English English, but anyways. The, or or sorry, the owners of the voucher are invited to find one Darius Petrescu's house and ask where Dorothea... Uh, Dorothy? Dorothea? Are this Dorothy and Dorothy Crane the same person? Is she the author of the blackmail letter sent to Lady Ashbury? I think I can... I'd fi better find, uh, sorry, 
I think I'd better go to Whitechapel as soon as possible to get all the needed answers from the nurse if I can find her there. Great. Alright, so I guess we can just leave now. We're good. I've looted everything. Can I suck this werewolf a little bit more, maybe? Pretty buff dude, I gotta say. Oh, I can't go that way, right, because of the great pool. Uh, let me get some juice. I have this thirst for blood. You don't fucking say. Do you I really can't have this? I'm doing this. Is that really the most reprehensible thing you've done tonight? I mean, you know, you talk to fucking uh, what's her face, that um, that blabbermouth rumor lady. That was pretty dis despicable. You didn't take a shower afterwards. She was nasty, with a capital T. Okay, so I have to go to Whitechapel, um, and that is well. Exactly. Oh, we should also speak to, um, uh, Blight Dude. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. That was my bad. Am I gonna have swirling blood around me after I go, um, go to see... What's his face? Okay, so I don't know how to cure headaches yet. It's locked, all right. But I'm sure maybe soon we'll be able to find some kind of, uh, Something that'll, um, some recipe or whatever that'll help us, uh, uh, discover how to make, um, cures for the headache. There were more of us with less resignation and more determination. I know I Shut your face, guys. Shut your face. Can I loot this? No. Okay. Where is... Where is he? Where is he? Um, where's Newton? I wonder if these guys are in here now. Okay, so that's the nurse, that's them, that's Sean. Hmm. Have you guys seen Newton Blight? It's a kind of short fellow with a very unfortunate name. Newton Blight. You know, kind of makes me uh, feel like maybe he brought the plague, uh... All by himself. Maybe. But probably not. Alright, so now that I'm level 9, I feel like I could probably maybe go to some more places. Places that I weren't able to before. Hmm. I don't think I need to rest right now. I could. And I think I can probably uh, jack myself up to a level 10, but. Anyone? Are you sure you guys haven't seen Newton? Fine. Oh wait, no, I found your knife, by the way. Hey, Doc. Shut your face. I have found a gift from your wife. In that case, you'll be properly rewarded, Doc. Clay Cox is a man of his word. I hope that won't make me an accomplice to your future crimes. Who knows what I might do now I feel invincible again. Ah, jeez. Fucking I'll leave prick. you for now, Mr. Cox. Wait, you only give me like 40 shillings? Are you kidding me? What a jerk. I'm just gonna look through this garbage now. Because you've only given me 40 shillings. I can't afford to, uh, look through all the good garbage in the hoity-toity neighborhoods. Um... So, I think I might be able to perhaps upgrade... No, I still need another common handle part. Okay, so I think maybe... Let's speak to, not Milton, but I think, um, Chandra, Chanandra, or whoever, that doctor, the Indian doctor, might actually have some Good common evening, handle parts. That right, right, cool please, beans. Of course. Yeah, yeah. I'm looking for common handle parts. You got some? Gotta be kidding me. That's all you got? I don't need fucking chemicals. Damn, son. Jeez. Right, fine. Maybe Milton does have some then. Right, Milton, buddy? You got some for me? Good evening. Good evening, Doc. Yeah. Why is your There we go. We got ourselves a common handle part. We'll buy that. Thank you very much. And I think what is this Milton shotgun? Holy crap. 
My god, not only is that expensive, that does a crap ton of damage. Alright, let me go upgrade my, uh, my sword now that I have the last common handle part that I need. What are you doing, Dr. Reed? That is reprehensible behavior. How dare you rub your chest up against the, uh, stair banisters. What the hell, man? Not cool. What if there were children around and they saw you doing that, like some kind of filthy degenerate? Good grief. Um, okay, so our weapon. We're looking to upgrade the Dragon Bane. Let's do it! Fantastic. And we can go for increased damage or increased blood absorption. Um... Really? Blood absorption? Uh, I kind of wonder if maybe I should just go for the damage then. Can I switch between the two later on if I really want to? Maybe I'll decide later. I don't know. Yeah, I'll decide later. There's no rush. No rush. Okay. Um, you know what? Let me actually try playing with the uh, new costume a little bit. See how I like it. If it seems a little doofy or goofy or spoofy or whatever, then maybe we'll uh, switch back. But yeah, let's give this a go. <laughs> the bowler hat. I do like the uh, outfit a little bit better. Though I do wish the uh, hat was... Uh, you know what? It's fine. It looks kind of distinguished. I don't know. The fuck do I know? Alright. Um, well, let's leave this off here and we'll continue on tomorrow. Um, we'll hopefully be able to maybe find Newton Blight. Maybe get some kind of reward. Find a uh, cure for the headache for... Um, the love child of Simon Pegg and uh, Carl Pilkington, and then uh, cure him, and then I think we should be good. Yeah, we might need to find out some more stuff about some of these gits, but that's about it. And yeah, we're getting there, we're getting there. Right, we also need to uh, do that too. Yeah, well, it might not be a bad idea. Although I kind of wish I could see the um, general level uh, um, well, the levels of the uh, areas here, but oh well, it's fine. Alright, so for now, thanks for watching and have a good breakfast.